Isn't it wonderful, Pookie? Ethan has decided to help us in our fight to get little Ethan away from Teresa. Ethan, what's going on? Did I hear you correctly? Uh, yeah, I agreed to look over these documents relating to little Ethan's custody, yes. Really? You see, Gwen, I told you Ethan would come around. Honey, I'm kind of surprised. You know, you seem really adamant about wanting Teresa to retain custody. I was surprised, too. I mean, I think, I think it's wonderful, but what happened to change your mind? Um, look, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, uh, can we talk later? I, I really need to look these over now. Okay, of course. Thank you. I hate deceiving you, honey, but I can't stand to watch an innocent child be taken away from his mother. I just can't. Number the woodman here. Woody, it's, it's Ethan. Hey, 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 Ethan, I was just on my way to, to, to Dessa's house. Good, that's good, but listen, listen. I, I just heard that Rebecca is planning on having Child Protective Services come and take little Ethan away today. Oh. Today? That's that freak out. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, but listen. I have a way to keep it from happening. I want you to listen to me carefully, and you do exactly as I say. You understand? We have little time, and I don't want you to alarm Teresa, but you have got to file a motion to extend Teresa's custody. What kind of motion would that be? It doesn't matter. It can say anything, as long as it's a motion that the court has to consider. Okay? It'll buy us some time. It'll prevent them from taking little Ethan today. Okay. Understood. I'm on it. I'll head over to the courthouse. File the paperwork, then I'll go to Tenesis. Okay, perfect, perfect. By the time Rebecca tries to take little Ethan away, it'll be too late. We'll have a court order, prevent her from taking the child. Unless. Unless what? What about that crook, Judge Riley? Julian Crane has him in his back pocket. Look, he may be on the Crane payroll. Right, but he still has to go through due process, or he'll risk exposing himself. Look, Woody, just file the, file the motion, okay? All right, all right. It's as good as done. And Woody, remember, Teresa must not know that I'm helping her. I know, I know, I got it. Mum's a word. I didn't think you'd be able to resist helping Teresa. I mean, even after you promised me you'd stay away from her. I'm staying away from her, and I just want what's best for little Ethan. And I firmly believe that it's best for little Ethan to be away from Teresa. Can I get you some coffee? No, thank you. Okay. Wrong when. It's best for little Ethan is to be with Teresa. She's his mother. Julian, I've just had the most brilliant idea. Lord help us. Now, I'm gonna let it slip to Teresa that Ethan is actually helping us to take little Ethan away from her. Then she's gonna hate and despise him, don't you think? She's never gonna forgive him. Oh, yes, I suppose. Well, then she'll never try to take Ethan away from Gwen. Oh, oh, oh it's time we go. Go, go where? Well, I've moved up the timetable to take little Ethan away from Teresa, and the CPS officer's probably already on his way over there. So, Ethan, Gwen, it's time we headed over to Casa Lopez Fitzgerald to uh, pick up Julian's son. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. I thought that was happening later. Change of plans. And, and I know you want to be there when we liberate little Ethan. Right, sure. I just have to make a quick call first. Oh, you can make that call later. No, 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 it's okay. It'll just take a minute. Go ahead and meet me outside. Oh, no, no, Ethan. I mean, none of this would be happening without your brilliant expertise. And I am so grateful to you, so very grateful that I've decided that, well, until we have custody of little Ethan, you and I are going to be joined at the hip. <laughs> 